It's really hard to make an argument against the fact that the two hottest teams on campus right now reside here at the McLeod Tennis Center. Both have come out in the top 16 in the country in this week's rankings as the Lady Raiders took possession of first place in the Big 12 Conference after beating Iowa State and West Virginia here last weekend. They are now looking for their third conference title in the past four seasons. However, we'd be remiss not to mention the men who after losing a player two weeks into this season have rallied back as they upset the number one team in the country this past weekend in Oklahoma four to three. Both teams, the women, boast four freshmen in the starting lineup while the men only have one senior and start two freshmen and they continue to make a push towards the top of the Big 12 Conference each and every week. This team loves playing for each other. They really get along, have a lot of fun. We kind of keep it loose and, uh, and I think it's shown. I think each team gels differently. Um, but talent wise, this is as much talent, if the most talent we've ever put on a court at one time. Um, maturity, they've matured so much quicker and they've learned from their mistakes and their losses so much better than maybe some teams in the past. Such a big fan of, of what he's doing out there. So uh, it, it is uh, special when both teams are, are doing well. And uh, you know, I've learned, Todd said that he's learned from me. I think I've learned more from Todd over the last couple of years, but he does a wonderful job and, and we both really support each other and that's what makes it fun. And it's also the same way with the teams. Uh, besides like making us believe that we could do it, I think like it also like helps the program to improve as a whole, like not just like men's tennis team or women's tennis teams, like the tennis team of Texas Tech. We're not so much underdogs anymore. People need to look out for us and we're coming to get them. You know, we wouldn't be where we were if it wasn't for the guys' team and their support. And we know how to, to push the right buttons and how, and how to fire the guys up and they know how to do the same. And so it would mean a lot to have the support of them and, and I feel like it would be the same for them. And then also, you know, for the community of Lubbock to get to see you know, four great matches on a weekend and, and, and give back to the fans and so much they've done for us, for both programs throughout the year. Now both teams are set to wrap up this season this weekend. On the road, the women will face TCU in Fort Worth while the men in a huge another opportunity to knock down a top team in the country. Number two Baylor comes to the McLeod on Saturday for a 6 p.m. start and then both teams will hit the road to Waco for the Big 12 championships next weekend. For Texas Tech TV, I'm Courtney Davis.